Packers leave one, and they're on the short end of an eight nothing score. That one is absolutely belted, and it one hops the wall. But now they hold him to a single. Doesn't have plus speed, so I guess they didn't want to try and stretch it there. Now here is Ryan O'Hearn. Well struck right field. And it's a one hopper off the wall. Should be extra bases. Throw comes in. Lead runner holds it third. And now runners at the corners. Great defense saved them a run on that single. And now the center fielder, Cedric Mullins. He's already homered here in this one. And there's a fly ball deep right field. That one is gone. Looks like this guy was looking out. So out of the bullpen for the Rangers, Jake Latz. I think it's got to be a little tough coming in out of the pen when your guys are trailing so big on the scoreboard. Just doesn't have the same intensity to it, but... He's got to find a way because these batters count the same for his stats, obviously, regardless of the score. And now it's Austin Hayes. Singled and drove in a run his first time through. On the ground to the nope, left. And it goes just foul. Lats measures six feet, two inches. He features a four-seam fastball, a changeup, a slot. That one ripped. Back. Now, Boo, clearly some frustration out there on the mound right now. I mean, that ball was so close to going foul. Would have been a long strike, but instead, batter gets rewarded. Did a nice job of getting to the pitch and hitting it hard enough to get over the fence. And it's caught for the out. So digging in, Jordan Westberg. He's 0 for 1. Hammered down the line. Could be extra bases. Around first and hustling for second. And that's a double. Oh, I'm sure he feels really good about that one. Absolutely punished that pitch. Wasn't fooled in the slightest. 109 off the bat. I think that means you put a pretty good swing on it. Scorch to center. No doubt about it. That is long gone. That was blasted to the moon. His second home run of the game. It's 15-0. Swung on, belted. Carter going back. And caught on the warning track. Two outs, space is empty. Anthony Santander at the plate. Now this one's crushed down the line. Hooking foul ball. Two down, nobody on. And it's fouled away. Look out, that ball was smoked. Man, I am so relieved that they have this netting down the lines. Just ensure safety for the thing. This one swung on and hit well. Way back there. And that ball is gone. That's the exact definition of hitting the ball where it's pitched, taking that outside fastball and driving it the opposite. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. And in one hops the wall. Throw cut off to second. And he's out. Cut down. Back at Globe Life Field. Here's the third baseman, Josh Young. Burns back to work. That clips the corner. Every pitcher wants run support, and having a lead is nice, but it can be challenging for some pitchers. I think keeping the mindset to attack instead of trying to be too fine and have too much finesse, go after hitters and get quick outs. In the air, right field. Santander drifts towards it. Makes the grab one away. Here's Nathaniel Lowe. The part about Burns' journey that's so interesting, former fourth-round pick out of St. Mary's where he pitched alongside Tony Gonsolin, and it's oh, one and one. But you go back and look at Corbin Burns in 2019. He threw 49 innings and had an 8.82 ERA. The Orioles up big in this one, bottom half of inning number two. 
next Arr! offering is in for a strike. The main adjustment <laughs> that Corbin Burns made was that he got rid of his four-seam fastball and really leaned on the cutter. That is his signature pitch. And now today, he is a cutter sinker guy, and the four-seamer really doesn't make much of an appearance. Well, that's a blue zone right there, or the cold zone on the hitting chart. Just doesn't have much success in that part of the strike zone. And a really good job of the pitcher executing. Try to go there as often as you can. The numbers are in your favor. Two outs, base is empty. Foul ball still, 0-2. Two outs. Three. And a swing and a miss. And that's that.